this demonstration I'm going to show you um, quite an exotic knot, it's called an AG chain knot I believe um, and this knot is used uh, quite extensively in vertical jigging for big game fish. Um, it's basically it's a shock absorber knot so although it's a very very strong knot and it keeps almost full strength of the line with the knot so that means that it doesn't weaken the line when you, you actually knot the line. Um, it also acts as a shock absorber, a bit like a car shock absorber or a bicycle shock absorber. So when you've got very low stretch lines like um, your fluorocarbons or your braided lines, um, this will actually give you some so shock absorption which may or may not actually help keep your line intact at some point or other. So when you're casting or if you get a savage take. Okay, so let's um, get into it. This is a simple knot, but it's very effective. Okay, so come in through the eye of the hook, as so. I'll put this line over here. Give yourself loads of line. Under one. Over two. Under over under over Six. under. And there you have it. This is an AG chain knot and you can do that you know as many times as you feel necessary but this actually acts as a shock absorber and you can get this line, this line is very strong but you can probably see it flexing with it and you're correct it is just a bunch of halved hitches basically but it's an extremely strong knot and that's why it's used for big game fishing. Um, if I wanted to finish this, I would probably give myself tag end, maybe that's a little bit long, but for illustrative purposes, this will do. And then I would finish it by doing this. I've actually done too much there. Let's take a little bit more. So give myself a short tag end and then I would just do that. That's never going to come back through. And that's it. AG chain knot.